Even though the 2018 California fires destroyed thousands of acres of forest and entire communities, the town of Paradise is rebuilding. Construction is going on at a rapid pace. Residents are returning as fast as the infrastructure and homes can be ready. Critical to the town's rebirth is the water supply. So during the rebuild process, the town is using polyethylene uh, service lines to um, bring new service lines to the re rebuild, uh, rebuilt homes in Paradise. Phillips is the town manager for Paradise. Before, he was in charge of the Paradise Irrigation District, the town's water utility. Uh, the undergrounding of utilities to the uh, repair of the water system. Uh, most of the materials that are being used is plastic. Plastic pipe used for utilities and in construction ranges from solid wall pipe for water to PEX used in plumbing applications to conduit typically found in telecommunication systems, plus very large diameter pipe for stormwater drainage. So the town decided to, to stick with polyethylene pipe through the rebuild process because of the ease of use. The soil material here in Paradise is very rocky. And so um, trying to bore through a, a, a uh, hardened copper pipe is very difficult where polyethylene is very easy to use, very easy to move around obstacles. Um, and, and also what we saw was that there was no correlation between contamination with polyethylene versus uh, with copper. And so the district decided to go back to using that for the rebuild for that purpose. Also, the cost of the polyethylene is much cheaper, uh, is not subject to so many fluctuations in the market. And so for that purpose, we decided to use polyethylene and then use polyethylene as our standard moving forward throughout the rebuild process. The pipe being used is Polyflex CTS High Density Polyethylene HDPE Water Service Tubing from Advanced Drainage Systems, ADS. It is resistant to rot and corrosion, can be easily installed, and is consistent with industry specifications for drinking water. This SDR9 poly tubing from ADS is produced in accordance with AWWA standard C901 and meets NSF 14 and 61 standards. According to the Plastic Pipe Institute, this means that the pipe is certified for drinking water systems and meets or exceeds health requirements. The pipe also meets the performance criteria of plastic piping components as stipulated by NSF. The pipe material, PE4710 HDPE, provides an excellent level of performance for trenchless and open cut installations. The, the town really likes polyethylene pipe because of the ease of use, um, being able to maneuver that around obstacles. Um, the other thing too is the, the ease of use for, for a homeowner that wants to move their meter from one location to the other based on, um, on where, their, where their building site is, where their building site was here before the fire, it's now moved to, to accommodate different things. Uh, the polyethylene pipe allows us to, to maneuver that pipe very easily to, to accommodate those customer requests. Uh, uh, seismically, it's, it's strong um, with, with some of the movements up here and uh, it just handles a lot of the, the rebuild process much easier than other materials that we've looked at. Uh, what the district saw was that most of the contamination from the fire was, uh, had no bearing on material. Um, that even with some of the galvanized and copper pipes that were in the ground, we saw the same amount of contamination or the same percentage of contamination with those type of materials as it was with the polyethylene. So when we decided to come back and rebuild, we decided to use polyethylene because of the ease of use and with the cost uh, being at a, uh, the best cost in, on the market, we felt that that was the best choice for Paradise for the rebuild process. We saw was, uh, again, the contamination wasn't uh, directed towards material type, it was directed towards uh, just the depressurization and how long that those chemicals sat in um, whatever pipe it was. So when it's all said and done, uh, there will be approximately 315,000 feet of service lines with the polyethylene material that will be used with the, within the rebuild of the town of Paradise. It makes uh, 
the, the rebuild process and the water service, getting the water service back to those customers much easier than it would be if we had to bore through with a, with a steel or, or a copper line. And so for that purpose, we decided to use polyethylene and then use polyethylene as our standard moving forward throughout the rebuild process.